Good morning guys, it's Gina. I was outside and I was about to pot up a couple of my grow bags and I thought maybe I'd turn on the camera and show you how I do this. So I'm going to be doing a bell pepper plant and some potatoes. Um, right now I'm going to be using this Pro Mix um, organic garden mix and I'm going to show you guys how I do this so let me set the camera up so you can see what's going into the bags I'm going to go ahead and get the dirt in the bags and I will be back all right guys so I got some dirt in my pods I added a little bit of water to my soil probably should have added a little bit more but that's okay because I'm going to water it after I get the plant in there I'm gonna water it really good so we can get it saturated so this is gonna be for my um, pepper this bag toss my dirt around a little all right so going to make a little divot down into the middle of this. All right. I am going to add some chicken manure in here at the bottom. About a tablespoon or so. I'm going to cover that up with some dirt. As the plant grows, it will reach that and feed. So here's the pepper that I'm planting in here. I know you're probably thinking, why are you planting it in this bag when you have all that garden space? Um, this is a bell pepper. I have six of them already in my beds. So because of how I mapped out my um, garden beds, this is one more than I needed, and actually, I bought these from a. Um, I actually bought this. Oh, I was gonna say Tractor Supply, but that is not where I got this at. But one of the big box stores. It was a six pack, and it actually had two plants in one of the sales, so I ended up with seven. So I'm gonna put the seventh one in here. So I'm gonna put it there. I'm just gonna now bring the dirt in around it. Then we're just going to press it down some. And as this grows up, I will probably, um, I might, we'll see. This is a seven gallon um, grow bag. So I might add a little bit more dirt, but I might not. Cause it won't need it, um, honestly. So we'll see, but that's all I'm going to do there and now our plant is planted so now we are going to move on to the potatoes and oh where did I put those one second guys all right guys so I got this um this is a little less than a pound of red Pontiac um, potatoes. I got this at a local nursery. I only picked them up. I saw they were 50 cents. And I was like, hmm, I don't think I have red honey eggs. Pretty sure I don't. So, this is what they look like. I could cut these into pieces because there's several eyes on it but I'm not I'm gonna plant the entire potato and there's two of them here's the other one saying oh, shoot be careful Gina almost knocked one of the eyes off but there you go so this is what we're gonna do here I'm going to this is just the the dirt that um and i added a little water to this one too sorry about that bumped the camera 
push this back some. All right, so I am gonna add some amendments to this. Because with potatoes, you don't really have to mess with them too much during their growing process. Just let them do their thing. Oh, sorry guys, I keep bumping the camera. I got my tripod stand close to this, so sorry about that. So anyway, I am going to add some blood mail. So, I don't know, about a handful. I'm going to add some bone mail. About the same. About a handful. It's windy out here, so it's blowing it. Try not to breathe that in. And then I'm going to add some earthworm castings. About a handful. Actually, probably a little bit. Hey guys, sorry about that. My camera or my phone ran out of space. So, anyway, I finished putting the soil in the bag. I mean, yeah, in the grow bag. And now all I need to do is water them in. You just want to water them in really good. And there we go. That is it. I already did the peppers. So now I'm going to sit these bags over in my garden area. But that's all we have to do. Alrighty. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you like, comment, subscribe, and please share if you like these videos. Talk to you later.